what do you think it did to those other competitors' mindset? The fact that you were just like there was no social media then. I mean, you had Peter yeah. McGough writing these mysterious articles about you. Kevin Horton taking these amazing like black and white photos. Peter did a great job. Yeah, but what yeah. do you think it did to their mindset? Well, like, like because I mean, Flex Wheeler always oh, used to look like, great yeah, at the Arnold, yeah. but then at the Olympia, it was like he'd fall apart almost. No, I words. guess I was like I the the bogeyman, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I was like the nightmare that, you know. If you don't know, <laughs> if you don't know much, right, then you can create more scenarios in your mind. Mm, mm. So, what the hell is this guy doing over in England? What's he going to look like this time? And they, you know, they used to see each other in the gyms, right? They yeah. mostly train at Gold's gym. Sean didn't train there, but he'd go up there like once a week or whatever. He'd go there periodically. Yeah. So they all knew about each other and whatever was going on in their personal lives. It was all like a little bit of a gossip circle there. Um, but they couldn't get any of that on me. They couldn't get any handle on me. So mm. they didn't really know who I was. And um, the image I presented was just this guy that doesn't smile. He just trains all the time and comes and, you know, um, and take the title away. So yeah. um, it gave me a psychological edge, I, I would think. Yeah. Mm. I think I think my greatest memory of you, Dorian, was the, uh, the 1992 British Grand Prix, the day after the Olympia. Because that was when you'd have to ring up Gold's Gym to get the results. Now, yeah. this, this was um, the Olympia that year was the, the first Olympia that Dorian won was in Helsinki, Finland. Dorian won that. Now, not many people actually knew the next day that Dorian had won. No, because there was no... So uh, they actually so. brought them all out through a, a, like a center uh, part of the stage with dry ice. And I remember then they, they kind of paused because they left Dorian till last. And then they said, and now the new Mr. Olympia. Mm. And I just remember the place went fucking ballistic mm. and i remember because dorian just came out hit a couple of poses and i think he just smirked a little bit and then just walked off it was like <laughs> like the place was going absolutely crazy and you're just like mm, okay <laughs> it was brilliant <laughs> so like, just like you it was like yeah, okay just another day at work you know fantastic right yeah i was i was uh, i was told that i should be more you know more of a showman more smiley on stage and all that stuff but nah. it just wasn't me man i was just being genuine that's yeah. that's how i was 